Well, as I mentioned about five minutes ago, we do have some really sad news this day before Thanksgiving. Mr. Food has passed away. His real name, Art Ginsberg, and he has been sharing easy and delicious recipes to viewers across the country since the 1970s. He had been diagnosed with pancreatic cancer just over a year ago, and he died in his Western Florida home this morning. Mr. Food was 81 years old. While he is no longer with us, he did record a number of cooking segments before his passing. Today, he and Howard are showing us the perfect way to carve a Thanksgiving turkey. Carving a turkey can be a real challenge. Well, that is if you're not armed with a few basic tips. And today, our test kitchen team has a few pointers to make anyone a carving pro like Howard. Well, thanks for the compliment. You know, every Thanksgiving, I volunteer and help feed thousands of people who are in need. And we carve hundreds of birds. Well, after doing so many, I came up with a way that's not only easy, it really guarantees the, the juiciest bird, and it doesn't have any of that last minute mess or stress in the kitchen. Okay, after cooking our turkey, we're gonna let it sit and cool for a little bit before carving it. This way, the juices won't run out and we won't burn ourselves. First, we're gonna remove the thigh and the drumsticks. We're gonna gently bend back the drumstick away from the frame and cut between the joint with a knife or kitchen shears. Next, we'll cut along one side of the breastbone like this, removing half of the breast all in one piece. It'll look like a, a big boneless roast. After doing the same thing to the other side, we remove the wings and place the cut up turkey in a heavy roasting pan. Pour some chicken broth over it. We're gonna cover it and reheat it right in our oven. Or you know what? Even faster, to free up that much needed oven space, we can steam it right on top of our stovetop. Takes only 15 minutes or so, and we'll have the juiciest turkey ever. We can even do this the day before. Either way, right before serving, slice the breast across the grain and it's ready to dish up. Look, the step-by-step -step carving tips are online now, along with a recipe for classic roast turkey as our gift to you. Happy holidays from our kitchen to yours. And may you thankfully enjoy every bit of the... Ooh, it's so good.